Hi, I'm Mike Ott. Um, I'm here with Pier Blossom Highway, Little Rock, and Lake Los Angeles. Um, and they're all three films kind of based around locations out in the California desert. You know, for Little Rock, I was interested in this idea of being stuck somewhere, like being stuck an outsider. Um, when I was traveling abroad, I was like always at festivals where I couldn't speak the language. And I just started thinking about what it must be like when someone comes to America and they can't speak the language and how hard that is to assimilate. Um, you know, so that was the inspiration for that. For Pier Blossom, I think the inspiration was a lot about uh, trying to figure out things about my friend who's kind of the lead character in it and uh, trying to figure out who he was as a person. In Lake LA, I'm still kind of trying to figure out what the inspiration was. I think it sometimes takes a while to figure out where it came from. You know, I, when I graduated high school, I didn't really know what I was going to do. I was kind of lost, and um, I moved to San Diego and was like in a punk band and not really doing anything with my life. And I ended up moving back home and um, just kind of randomly took a, a Super 8 class at a junior college. And from that, made a short film, and it was kind of the first thing I ever felt that I could, like, that I wasn't terrible at. And, like, it felt like I kind of understood it immediately. Um, and then I went to CalArts, and you know, from there I made my thesis film as a feature called Analog Days, which was about the town that I grew up in and kind of a self-portrait of my friends and all these things, which took a long time. It took me like three years to finish it. Um, and so that was kind of like the hardest thing I ever did was making that movie. But it was like the biggest life lesson on like how hard it is to make a movie. And from doing that, I think it really pushed me after I finished it to like keep making work. Um, and now things actually all seem kind of easier after getting over that hump of like trying to make this feature w with literally no money with your friends where one DP is leaving for a week and you have to get a different DP and half the crew doesn't show up and an actress quits halfway through the shoot. Um, so yeah, it was like the hardest time of my life, but kind of the best filmmaking experience, just like hopping in and trying to do it. Mm -hmm.